I knew that little bitch would be back to get me and I have no- Oh fuck, I have no flippin' shit, you little hoe. Hello everyone, it is DaffyDuck91 here from Not A Gamer Gaming, and as you can see, I am all alone. There is no husband. Well, he's here, he's on the map. We wanted to think of something to kind of kill time, so we wanted to just stick around on vanilla, have some fun. What we're going to do is play separately, um, but on the same map, so we might run into each other, but the idea is to see the difference in how he would play the game and how I would play the game. So what's going to happen is I'm going to upload to YouTube our my day first, and then the following day I'm going to upload his first day. And then we'll keep doing that for as long as, you know, we're still having fun. There's no challenge. It's not who dies first, because let's be honest, it's going to be me. I'm going to die. I'll probably die today, because you know, guys, I'm super pro at this game. But that's okay. I'm doing it for fun. I spawned in the desert. What I'm going to do is all those beginning quests, we've seen them a million times, so let's just rush right through them and head to the trader, and I'll catch you guys at the trader. Okay, I hear our first zombie. Hello, Big Daddy. You have the honor of being my very first kill. And I'm being intimate. I'm going to get right up in your face, and I'm going to take your head off. <laughs> yeah. Is that the trader right there? That's no, no way. I was literally just doing my quest. They're not even done. You can tell in the corner. And I wandered to the nearest trader. Okay, so I'm going to just stick around here. I see a bunny, but I'm not even going to attempt to get that. I don't even have a bow and arrow. Okay, so I see the trader. I also see... I, th I can't remember the name of the town. Depar departure? I can't remember. Anyway, that's probably a decent place to live. Or even right there next to it. That's really close to the trader. And there's little buildings over there. There's just so much to pick from. Um, Genosis isn't a huge fan of the desert, uh, because, well, it's hot and there's not a lot of resources. But I like to be a rebel. I like to live life on the edge. I might just stay here, hang out, get a tan, because you know Ginger's tan? There's a bird flying over my head. It's driving me nuts. Um, okay, so I'm just going to finish my quest here, and then we are going to, um, get the trader, spend our points, and then find a place to live. That's our mission. I do want to ask if you guys are enjoying the video, if you want to see more of it, make sure you like the video and also if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. It helps a lot. I really appreciate it. Uh, definitely hit that bell notification button because as I said, Genosis' thing is going to, his video, his first day is going to come out right after mine. I think I said that already. If not, it's going to come out right after mine and you don't want to miss it. Yeah, so um, hit that bell like this. Hit it hard like that. Okay, let's finish these quests, let's get into that trader, and find somewhere to live. Okay, so I'm done my quests, I have my bow and all my crap, I've done the, the building, the base, the campfire. That bird is still sort of waiting to eat my face, I'm sure I'm going to see it soon enough. Lucky for me, as I said, I wandered into the trader, so he's right here. I'm just going to kill this uh, little G, and then we're going to go in, get a nearby quest, just because we're here, and spend some points. So far, so good. I mean, I'm handling myself. I haven't died yet. Um, killed a few zombies. Getting some experience. Let's get Dan on his knees here if we can. Probably should have thought about spending points before taking on these bad boys. Okay, trader time. Good idea too is I'm gonna loot the trader in case he's got some goodies for me, like a cooking pot. That would be fantabulous. The nails are nice too. So let's go quickly talk to him and loot the place and then find a home. Welcome hey Bob, you little grease monkey. Have you seen my husband? He is somewhere here. Uh, do you have any jobs for me today, Bob? Uh, let's get you, you feel close. You the man. I am the man. Now, if you see my husband, remember to tell him that we are still married despite us not being together and to stay away from the big mamas. You have to tell him that. Who is beating on these doors? Okay. I'm going to loot. Check and see if there's anything working here. That'd be nice. Little sham sandwich. Battery. Oh, so we have a working 
uh, workbench. That's good to know. I think that's handy. I'm, I'm not really sure. I don't know a lot about the crafting in this game. That's one of the fun things about me playing by myself. I'm actually gonna learn a bit more in that regard because I always had Jen just do it for me. Like most smart women, they just know their strengths. Mine isn't crafting, but it is now time to learn to be independent of the husband. I hear zombies beating on the wall. I'm just ignoring them right now. I want to finish this um, looting process. I know there's some... Oh, here we go. Do you work? No, you don't. But 16 steel. Nice! Do you work? No, you don't. And you got nothing in you. What about you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you guys knocking. I will be right there. Big Daddy, he wants to go on a date. Do you work? No. Okay, so we just have the workbench here, which I think is good. It would have been nice to have a cement mixer. That's what they tell me anyway. Uh, but I'll settle. I'll settle for the workbench. I ain't greedy. Now, what would be really nice is if we find a cooking pot. Like in here. Some water. Glasses. Nothing. Oh, didn't check in here. Don't give up. Paint! Paint is like the best thing you can find in this game. I can see, see, if I want to live in the desert, which I, I think I do, I feel like water is like my most important thing that I have to find. Oh yeah. Got myself a shirt, a leather duster. Apparently those are like super good. Uh, loot here. I'm hearing all kinds of nonsense out there. What do I have up here? Anything good? Nothing. Okay. We looted the trader. I have a ton of stuff. I just should go quickly through it. Oh, I don't want to drop that. I want to scrap it. I'm just going to go quickly through it and see if I can save some space. I really don't want the sand. I'm sure there's enough of that here. Uh, what else can I scrap? Okay, so I scrapped as much as I can. Oh, Jesus! How did you get in here, lady? We are at the traders. How did you get inside this building? Tell me. Trader Bob would not be happy to see you. How on? I didn't think they could get in here. Now I'm right scared. Are they down? Did I bring a setting up or something? Did you? She must have. They must have piled on top of each other, and then jumped out. Oh. My god, the traders are not safe. I repeat, the traders, they're not safe to be in right now. Oh god, there's like, how many of them are there? There's more over there too. There's Big Daddy. Pearly, you're still alive. Bob is not going to do any business with me since they bring all you nasties to his place. Okay. Who else is banging? Okay, I'm going to go grab Big Daddy. My god, there's like six of them. It's like a little horde. Okay, Bob, I know I brought the chaos, but I clean up my messes, and that is what I did. There was quite a few zombies kicking around, and I didn't know this, but they can get in. They can jump over each other and get in. Uh, let's look at my points. Now, the first four points, I've always had uh, Jen tell me how to spend them, so I spend them the same way. I get one um, in Boom Headshot, and then I get one in Lucky Looter. And then I head here, I get one in Hidden Strike, and then finally one in Pack Mule so I can carry a little bit more. I don't know if that's the right way to spend my points. Um, definitely let me know in the comments if you have a specific way you like spending your first four points because uh, I'm all about backseat gaming. I, in fact, encourage it. Again, I, I cannot promise I'll listen to what you guys say because I have, um, what's that, that thing, that attention... Thing that I don't, I don't know. I just, I like to have fun. But sometimes on the off occasion, I retain something. Now, I believe that's a big town over there, which I kind of want to live in because why not? There's going to be tons of POIs. A bird's still following me. 
There's going to be lots of POIs, plus it's sort of close to the trader. I mean, it's not like down the road or anything, but at least like if I wanted to go to the trader, I knew where it was. So yeah, I mean, I should have marked the trader on my map. That would have been like a pro gamer thing to do. <sighs> Jen's going to hold that over my head forever. Okay, let's get there. That's where we're going. We obviously have a few zombies to get through, and then we're going to pick a house. Oh god. So much blood. Oh, I should put a bedroll down just in case. It's probably a good idea. Definitely. Oh, I knew that little bitch would be back to get me, and I have no... Oh, fuck. I have no flippin' shit. You little hoe. Die. 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 Just get my bow out. Fuck out. Okay, I might bleed to death, guys. <laughs> Can I make a bandage? Do I have any cloth? Ban. Oh, God damn it! No, God! Oh, God! You little Bethany. Okay, guys, I stopped bleeding. I might survive this. First, I'll get that in a sec. I'm just gonna kill these guys off. Okay, bird's nest. Thank you. I'm going to keep that on the ground just in case, and we are going to continue our journey to, I believe it's departure. Could be wrong. Got to read the name of it. I'm not 100% versed in the Navis game world. I know some bits and pieces from what we've been doing for the channel, but I haven't overly explored it. So a lot of stuff is new for me. Anyway, let's go there, find a place to live, uh, and settle in for the night. Maybe find a cooking pot. I would be cooking pot approved. Okay, we have made it. Okay, I gotta read departure. That's what I thought. So we've made it to departure. There are tons of skyscrapers. There is no chance I'm going in any of those to live. So let's, you little bitch. I see you. I, I know you're coming for me. Are you thinking about it? There you go. Oh, and darling. I can't believe I hit that bird. Sometimes I impress myself. Like, I'm so bad at this game. There we go. Now, can I get some feathers from your fine booty? There we go. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, so as I was saying, there's lots of skyscrapers. I don't want to live in a skyscraper. I don't want to live in Joe Bros. I'm not saying I'm not going to go in there and get all their yummy... Oh my god, a pig. Yummy loot. But at the same time, um, this pig is, it might kill me. Oh, sweet. Okay, but at the same time, yeah, it's too big for me to live in. I don't want to take it on. It's my first day. I still would really love to find a cooking pot. I'm going to make a bone shiv or bone knife. Get me some, some goodies. I'm very encumbered, but there's nothing I really want to get rid of. So I'm just going to hobble my way. Jitters, I see you. Just fuck up. I'm going to hobble, hobble my way to somewhere to live, really. That's kind of where I'm at. Okay, where do we want to live? Where, oh, where do we want to live? Oh, you know what? That's perfect. Uh, Jason would hate me because I'm just, oh, you little bitch. Bruh! Stop it! I should put down another bedroll. Is there another one of you? I see you, you little cock blocker. Get it, because it's a chicken. It's a cock. Blocker. Frig off, guys. I'm busy. I'm trying to rule the desert. Somebody has to. Thank you. God. <sighs> okay, yeah. Jen would be mad at me because he hates that I picked the first thing I see, but I mean, I'm, I'm easy to impress. That house looks good. It's it's big enough to fit my crap. It, I think it's made of, of concrete, maybe? Um, or s at least like cobblestone. I don't know. I have to go hit it with my axe to find out. But yeah, so it's, it's going to be relatively safe. Maybe I can make my horde base like right across the street on this uh, broken down area. Sorry, Brittany. So I'm going to make a bedroll and a storage crate and lay my crap down. Uh, and then we're going to go in and loot it. Okay, that took a little bit longer than I thought it was going to, but we have our bedroll. We have our chest. I'm going to dump all of this stuff in there. Oh, fuck. Sorry. 
That's what I get. That's what I get for uh, playing too much art. So we're going to put all this in here, except for the things I'll need to take over um, that POI. God, I got lots of feathers. I love the desert. Okay. So I got some, I don't need that murky water, but got some water, got a bow and arrow, got quite a few zombies wandering around. There's a good chance they're going to come and eat my face um, when I'm in here. Uh, hopefully not. I'm going to hit this, see if I can get stone out of it. There we go. Repair my stone axe. Okay. Yeah, Kyle, see, you're already coming. I'm going to get rid of him now in my attempt to get into that POI. Okay, this is not one of the dungeon styles, so nothing's unlocked. I'm gonna have to wang and bang and maybe not wake everything up in there. Okay, that's a good start. Here we go. So yeah, this seems uh, good for me. Oh, Roger, wanna come visit me on my first day here? I should really think about putting some doors up, securing the place, and then we're gonna hunger down here for the night. Uh, ideally, let's see if there's a cooking pot. That's kind of my first goal. So I'm gonna leave my stuff out there for now because uh, I don't need to bring it in. Let's loot the crap out of this place. Maybe there will be a cooking pot so I don't have to go outside. Okay, so there was no cooking pot, so unfortunately, I mean, we still have some time left in the day. Maybe there's like a small house, maybe the poopy pants daycare, that house over there might have a cooking pot. So let's go look quickly. Uh, I'm going to see if I can build a door. How many of these? Can I make two doors. I'm going to put two doors down. I feel like that's a song. Maybe it's three doors down. And we're going to put them up and then go check out maybe that. I'm thinking that house right there. That little tiny one. It's another easy one like this. Oh shit, that light scared me. Okay, here we go. Once I get that done, I don't think there's going to be much time. Ah, damn it. Seriously, seriously, seriously. That again. You like it's out there. He doesn't want to come in. Okay, try this again. Yes, so when I feel like there's not a lot of time, we're going to do that one. Hopefully, cross our fingers, there's a cooking pot so we can drink some bev. Um, if not, we're going to hunker down and look for one tomorrow. Okay, here we go. This is the same thing. It's not one of the dungeon styles, so we're going to go in hot and heavy. And by that, I mean I'm going to be on my knees sneaking the entire time because I have that sneaky... I honestly think that's the best way I'm going to play this game if I really try to amp up my sneaking ability. Um, I, I don't think I'm coordinated enough to go in Guns of Blazing, so if I can just sneak most of this time, I think I might not die as often. I'm pretty impressed that I haven't died yet. Or did I die? No, I didn't die. I almost died. It did get a little hairy there when the bird decided to hang out with me. Excuse me. See, I don't get that. Why is there a toilet in the basement in the most random place you could put a toilet? Can somebody, like, figure that out for me? Who puts a toilet? Like, would you poop there? Oh, Sylvia, would you poop there in that toilet? Is that where you poop? I'm mostly curious why they had you locked in a basement like some nurse servant. I'll put you out of your misery, girl. There you go. What do we have in here? Oh, there's uh, quite a few Sylvia's locked in here. Now, what sick, twisted person does that? Can I get this one? Ah, no, I didn't think so. So yeah, I'm going to do sneaking. I'm going to do arrows, because that's a good thing to use while sneaking. Maybe like a ninja. He's not even going to know what's coming. He's going to be so, so swift. 
Oh, pain pills. Get that for some wood. I'm not even attempting to hit safes right now. I have nothing good for that. I'm, I'm scared that I might have woken up the entire house by not crouching. So, uh, maybe I should make a bandage. Maybe not 28 of them, that's really excessive. Maybe 10 of them. Then we get something going on. Okay, that's what I thought. More nurses. I wonder if this is like a college uh, nursing place. Do you rent all these ladies? Is there some weird perversion behind all of this? Okay, I gotta go inside. I need some space. Whew, okay, I wonder if they're all gone. See, I just, I really want a cooking pot. I'm pretty okay with everything. Damn it. Let's repair this. Need to grab a stone. I just need one stone. Do you have a stone? Nice. Okay. I feel like it's the second time I've done that today. Seriously? Who did I piss off now? Oh, I see you. I see you, you sneaky, sneaky little B-word. Fuck, those birds are driving me nuts. Kyle, I'm busy. I just want a cooking pot. It's almost my bedtime, and I haven't found one. So please just get out of my way. Okay, so I hear something hitting. I know there's another level, like an upstairs to this place. The nurses all came out of there with the big daddy. Okay, I'm gonna go upstairs quick. I'm gonna crouch a little bit. There you go. I think these guys are kind of strong, these skater boys. Like, you wouldn't think so, but I have a hard time telling them. Yeah, I'm right there, ding -a -ling. There. You're dead. What's left up here? I know there's like two rooms. One here. Anything mean? No. Anything mean in here? Yes. Oh, sorry, lady. Don't mean to wake you up. You can go back to sleep. That was easy. All right, guys, let's loot. I can't loot a bed. I don't have a wrench. Gonna leave it. Uh, I am gonna get these because God knows I will need bandages. I'm not. I'm not very on top of bandaging myself and like doing stuff like that. So that's one thing I'm gonna have to work on. I'm gonna have to work on that. Remembering to like eat and drink. These are also things that I don't do on my own. I know it seems silly, but like Jen always reminds me to do stuff like that. Get cooking pot. Yeah, it's no use to me. Nope. Nope. We're not looking good, guys. Ah! Another pig! Oh, one shot. Yeah, baby. I didn't even bring my bone shift. How am I not that smart? Whatever. I'll just chop it. There we go. I didn't want to make another bone shiv. I know I could have, but whatever. I'm, I'm not feeling the luck on this. Oh, a wrench! Nice! Uh, yeah, I'm not feeling any luck on getting a cooking pot from this house, so we might have to go with it because it's almost nighttime. We're not going to be recording at night. Uh, that's mostly when we're going to do all of our grinding. So I think if I have enough wood and such uh, tonight, I'm just going to um, just fortify sort find my place. Actually, right now, can I make any spikes? I feel like I want to make some spikes at least put them in front of the door. Alright. That was a bust. There's nothing good. I, oh, I want this bird for its feathers. Derp. I guess I could get one more kill. Just some experience before bed. Oh, fuck. Okay. Here we go. Back home. Okay, so it's almost my bedtime. I am going to get this tree and that tree because I can make some spikes. I just want to put them outside uh, my doors just in case some zombies want to come hang out with me tonight. I don't have a lot to defend myself. Mainly, I don't have my husband. 
That's that's normally who I use to defend myself, but he's uh, slacking off, doing his own thing. Can't put up with me anymore, or something like that. So here we go. We're in for the night. I'm gonna put a spike here. Uh, note to self: Do not step on this spike when you leave the house tomorrow. That is definitely something I would do. There we go. Okay, so we're spiked in. Do I have enough wood? I'll upgrade some doors. Upgrade. Oh, yeah, upgrade some windows because they can beat through those, right? Upgrade that window. Uh, do the rear door here. Okay, and I'm going to go hide. I'm going to hang out upstairs. I'm going to go to bed. Uh, right here. That sounds good. Um, yeah, that's it for today, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, uh, like the video, and also hit that bell notification because tomorrow you're going to be seeing uh, Genosis' first day by himself. I'm sure um, he's not going to be as successful as I was, but you never know. Um, hit the bell notification because if you don't, you'll miss it, and you don't want to do that. Thanks again for watching, guys, and have a good night.